Hello, I'm Jeffrey Mindish. Welcome to Formosa News. And I'm Ginny Chang. The National Palace Museum is under fire for allowing an arts auctioneer access to its storerooms. In its defense, the museum says that the auctioneer is a special assistant to the convener of the museum's advisory committee and was in the convener's presence during the visit. The heavily guarded storeroom of the National Palace Museum has red doors that lock securely with a blue piece of paper sealing the doors. For added protection, cameras offer a 360-degree view. Despite these strict security measures, there is speculation that an assortment of people has privileged access to enter. PFP legislator says that on April 28th of last year, Guanda Chairman Barry Lam and members of a French arts construction team came to examine a storeroom. Lam, who is a deputy director of the museum and a convener of its advisory committee, also let his friend, Clara Guo, join the tour. Guo is an arts auctioneer. Legislator says that Guo does not represent academic institutions and is not a scholar with research needs. Therefore, the lawmaker feels she does not meet access requirements. The only lawmakers who have ever gone into the storeroom are conveners of the advisory committee. What kind of pressure are the director and two deputy directors under that they feel they can let certain people enter the storeroom? The National Palace Museum defended Guo's visit. We don't grant special access to our storerooms. Ms. Guo, as far as I know, is the special assistant to Barry Lam who was convener of the advisory committee of the National Palace Museum. She accompanied him on the visit. The National Palace Museum says important guests who wish to visit the storeroom must receive permission from the museum director.